Hey everyone, I'm Brendan from Taramara Music. You could probably ask anyone here at the shop and they'll tell you that I'm a huge fan of Blackstar. And it's not just because they make amazing sounding amps, it's because they, every now and again they'll put their thinking caps on and they come up with something that changes the game. They did it with their patented ISF technology, they did it with the ID cores, and they've done it again. They've had other pedals in the past, but they've taken what was great from the HT and LT lines, distilled them into a new, exciting amp in a box product. With more cab simulation options, USB audio, XLR out, and effects loop, these guys are pedal board ready. Today we're going to be using the direct out cab sim options, but I can assure you, you plug these into an amp and they sound just as good. They work just like a normal distortion pedal and they really, you know, come into their own. But we're going to be using the cab sims just to show off that feature as well. Okay, so first off, we're going to try what everyone in the store affectionately calls the Brendan method. We're going to have all the EQ all the way up, just like you would on a Fender style amp. There's no change in the EQ. So it's pretty full sounding. Now we're going to sweep the ISF, which is sort of the point of origin. So taking it from sort of fendery to something a little bit more British, Marshall E. Vox. Take it back again, just for contrast. It's a subtle difference in there in the mid range. Anyway, so let's undo the Brendan method. We'll go back to more American sounding. Very lush. It's a really great clean sound. One of the things I've always loved about Blackstar gear is they'll give you a clean channel, but you can also push it like a push clean. And that obviously sounds different to a gain channel. Let's switch to crunch. So that gets you into rock and roll zone a little quicker. We'll sweep that ISF. ISF doing its job there. So yeah, crunch channel. Okay, so you've got a crunch and an OD on channel two. So the crunch just takes it from where you were on channel one and gives you more. And compared to channel one. That one's a little tighter, you got a little hair on your channel two. Um, so yeah, just more gain there. And then we go to overdrive. In essence, you've got like five sounds. I don't know who I'm looking at. You've got completely clean, DI. You've got clean, which obviously I've got a little dirty here. Then you got your crunch. Then you got your crunch two. Then you got your overdrive. So 
they've really tuned this guy to be a lot like an amp, which is sick that it's like this big and it sounds ampish. Uh, quick rundown of the cabs. Cab one's tight. Cab two is a little scooped. Cab three. It's kind of the midiest. It's got the most mixed. Sort of a negative cab two. Super versatile. Crazy versatile. Anyway, let's move on to the dual distortion. Again, we've got the Brendan method here. All bass, all mid, all treble. And we're gonna start off with the clean tone. Uh, let's have a listen to the crunch channel. Let's set it about there for a nice crunch. Got a bridge pickup. British and American. It's genius. All right, let's switch over to channel two. Now this is where we get something that's a little different to the first two channels, kind of similar, clean, crunch, but this is where we get the high gain overdrives. So we got OD1. You can really hear the mid-range on the overdrive. And overdrive two, more gain again. So if you needed more gain after overdrive one. Crazy amounts of game. Let's listen to these cabs. That's cab one, cab two. Again, that scooped mid range. And this will be the push mid range on cab three. So as you can hear, these pedals are pretty much no joke. They can cover a wide range of sound. A range, is that the word? No. So as you can hear, these pedals are no joke. They can cover a wide array of sounds for anything from super clean, crystal bell-like jazz tones to filthy black metal ridiculousness. There's something you should definitely throw into the mix if you're looking for a preamp pedal to do a wide range. I did it again, a range. What is that? They're definitely something you should throw into the mix if you're looking for a preamp pedal to cover a wide array of sounds, or if you're looking for a preamp pedal to build a micro rig around. Anyway, I'm Brendan from Taramara Music. These are the Dept 10 Dual Distortion, Dual Overdrive. Come in and check it out by appointment at the moment. There's also a boost.